Hello, this is Collar of Sublime Trading. In this episode of Mentoring Mondays, we're going to cover how to find the best trends. It's all well and good being able to identify breakouts and entry signals, which on its own can make us profitable. But what we want to do is go that one step further and identify and enter the best looking trades. Entering slow moving trends versus fast moving trends can have a big impact on how much profit is accumulated over a given period of time. Trends move in different ways. Some move consistently in the direction with shallow pullbacks lasting a few days at a time before resuming the trend. These are the types of trends that we want to trade. Some trends move consistently in one direction but can experience deep pullbacks along the way before the trend resumes. These are still good trends, but it means we have to endure going through phases where our profit and loss goes up and down. Seeing the profits fluctuate like this can have its toll on traders, affecting their psychology, making some traders run in fear and causing them to exit trades early at the sight of these deep pullbacks. Exiting early is the wrong thing to do as these trends usually go back into profit. Understanding this will help us control our emotions and withstand the ups and downs we may see in our broker account. The next type of trend is our least favorite because with this one, price may trend well but will experience periods of consolidation as well. The duration of consolidation can vary from weeks to months and what we really don't want is to have our capital tied up in a trade that is going nowhere. We can identify how a particular stock or forex pair trends by looking at its history. By simply looking at the chart, we can see the behavior of the instrument we are about to trade. Of course, the behavior can change over time, but past behavior is a good indication of things to come. Look to see whether price consolidates for long periods of time and get an idea of how price pulls back when in a trend. Are there deep or shallow pullbacks? The opportunity with the least amount of pullbacks should be at the top of your watch list. Good trends are ones that move cleanly in a given direction. The steeper the trend is, the better the trend, which is ideal for making fast profits. The added benefit is that fast moving trends allow you to compound and enter more times in the same trend a lot sooner than you would in a slow moving trend, resulting in an exponential profit in a shorter period of time. Another way to position yourself for fast moving trends is to spot markets which have been in consolidation for long periods of time. The reason why this is important is because the longer price remains in consolidation, the bigger the move in the direction of the breakout. So look at instruments that have been in consolidation for at least over a year. Set up alerts on your trading software to alert you as and when breakouts occur so they can be immediately added to your watch list. If price breaks out and remains beyond the consolidation zone, then price will more than likely continue to move or trend in that direction. If we have a breakout of the consolidation zone resistance level, then we may see fast moves to the upside. And if we have a breakout of the consolidation zone support level, then we may see further moves to the downside. Remember, not all breakouts will be followed by a big trend, but you only need to have a few good trends to make good profit. Patience is required to wait for the best setups. It is easy to get frustrated waiting around for the best opportunities, and some traders may become eager and jump into bad trades just for the sake of trading. But you will learn sooner or later that not only will you lose money most of the time, but you will also be affected psychologically and may even become fearful about taking more trades in the future. It is important to trade well right from the start so you can keep your money and sanity intact. As the trading expression goes, trade well, not often. This is the difference between traders that consistently grow accounts and traders that repeatedly blow accounts. So remember, when you are looking for trends, choose the trends that move well. They should have shallow pullbacks and little to no history of long periods of consolidation. Fast moving trends will allow us to get risk free sooner, as well as give us opportunities to compound in a shorter period of time. The end result will be a healthy looking trading account, as well as a healthy stress free lifestyle. Thank you for watching this episode of Mentoring Mondays. Don't forget, new episodes are released each and every Monday, so don't miss a thing and subscribe below.